So we stalk up to this hippo, to this pod of hippo, and you know he points out the bull, and he's just like, "You've got one shot, Sin, because if you don't hit it right, the hippo goes under. The entire pod of hippo starts freaking out, and there's no way you can get it. You know, and, and this is like in croc-infested waters and everything. So I'm like, okay. So he gets up. He's like, "There's the bull," and I take the shot. Yeah, you got him. Okay. <laughs> and it's just bullseye. That was a great shot. <laughs> and I was so excited, and the hippo just dropped. And then I'm like, oh, that was so fun. And then he turns to me, he's like, okay, now we gotta go get it. <laughs> so that's when the real hunt began. Work You'll together. swim in and get it? Yeah, yeah. But it's, uh, it's a lot of work. I thought getting the hippo in wouldn't be a problem. <laughs> you know, because we'd just pull it through the water. No problem. What I didn't realize is that the mud is, you know, waist deep, and that's what these hippos wallow in. Part of the tracker's job was to keep this pod of hippo away from them. They had to make a ton of noise, and they were throwing rocks and sticks and everything, and you know, that's what you do is you clap and you scream and yell to get rid of the other hippos that are coming in for them. You know, you get that close to, to a pod, you gotta be very, very careful. You get a, you know, those, those hippos, they'll, they'll come for you. And when, especially when you, you waist deep in mud, you're not gonna get out the way. It's, uh, so it, it's always a concern. I mean, that's the most dangerous part of actually getting there. I'm gonna have. Yeah. And we're just bringing this thing in. It's 3,000 pounds. And it's getting stuck in the mud. And a couple times the rope broke and like everybody went falling over. It was hysterical. Yeah. <gasps> uh, we've got the hippo halfway in, halfway to the shore, <laughs> he's stuck in the mud. Oh, yeah. 3,000 pounds, over a ton. Oh, yeah. and, uh, so we've got to try and roll him over as they pull him out with the car. <laughs> Think it's going to work? <laughs> It was just, it took us over an hour to get it in. But man, it was fun. <laughs> well done. Well done. Ah! Wow. Check that ivory yeah. out. Holy crap. They're like razor sharp tusks. Oh my gosh, I had no idea. I thought they were, um, I didn't know we had choppers like that. Oh yeah. For some reason, I thought they were square. Call me an idiot. You hear how hippos just chomp people in half? I was like, that's just, how can they do that when they've got, you know, these square little teeth? And no, no. They're, I mean, their jaws are like pit bulls, but six times the size. It's like, oh, freak me out. <laughs> That'll chop you right in half.